Welcome to Board Game Empire. Today we're going to do an unboxing of the Reckoners. It's uh, one of six players, 14 up, 75 minutes. Um, I believe this is the epic one. And so we're going to just do an unboxing and dive right into it. Okay, so we got to open the seal. This is gonna take a while. So it's a pretty big box. So gotta keep everything in the center. Let's try to get this open. There, so we could uh, put the pieces in there. Let's move this a little to the bottom. Kind of limited the space here. This box is huge. Okay, so first thing we have is stickers. We have the game rules. We have meet the reckoners, introduction, note to readers. Game components. We have game setup. We have epic overview. Play, reckon our space. Here we have some more information. Plan tokens, dice use examples, working as a team. Steel heart, receive rewards, epic rewards. Purchase equipment, epic phase. Ability equipment, power cards. Epic Actions, Rule Summary, okay, here we have a player board, or actually it's, uh, let's see, I don't know if this is a player board or have to see the rules and everything. Okay, untold epics. So here we have some uh, character information. Definitely have to read the road book to figure out what all this stuff is. Here we have some more trays. And you can tell it's already being punched out. I'll have to remember how to pull the stuff back. Here we have uh, Abraham, one of the characters. Another character. Another character, Megan. Another one. Here we have a whole bunch of dice. I like that. I move aside. Really like the dice design. It's 
So we can finish uh, looking at all the characters and now we'll look at the dice. Here we have David. Cody. Oh wow. Here we have a whole bunch of more dice. I think this is actually the dice tray. So here we have some more trays. Medium Millennium Park Power Plant. The Navy Pier. We have the Magnificent Mile. The Loop. The Theater. Museum campus. Okay, so, here, let's move this stuff. Actually, let's look at this. So, we got some uh, punch outs. Maybe this goes over here. We have a steel heart. Support punch out. It's back. Okay. So we'll look at some of the dice. There's quite a few of them. So probably some of the coolest dice I've seen, and there you can tell they're uh, quite big. They're not your uh, standard size. They're probably twice the size of a normal uh, dice that we get in board game. Okay. Here we have a little uh, punch out. So lots of look at. Here we have a uh, metal character. S looks like Steelheart. Try to keep all this together. So I remember where everything goes. Okay. Characters. Here's the painted ones. It's nice to have them already pre painted. to get these uh, back in where they need to be. Cool character was Soar. So this is like the character I'll probably use. Okay, so those are the actual uh, pre-painted ones. Okay, let's uh, look in here. So 
So these are the little soldier characters. Looks like all of them are uh, very similar. That's over here so you can see. Okay. Then we have, uh, let's see. We have this. We have the bottom, obviously. So you have uh, see one, two, three, three. You have six different colors. You have your black, blue, green, purple, orange, and red. And you have these metal tokens. These are really cool. I'm very impressed with the metal tokens. Try to put these back in there. Okay, so that's pretty much. Um, let's see. Get this back all in. Closed. Might have to do that later. It's one thing the I must say, it's a lot. Okay, so let's put this up here. Now we're just gonna look at this stuff. See if these are metal or wood. These are wood. I'm in there, I thought they were uh, magnetic. All right. I think these are wood. They're pretty thick though. Here we have some more pieces. It's gonna be quite hard to uh, make sure everything fits back in there. Although it's even a big box, it's just uh, quite a lot. Okay, so, so I'm back so I don't forget that it goes all in the same uh, the Ziploc. Get all the air out. Here. Okay, so we haven't looked at this. Oh, actually, these are metal. These are uh, metal pieces. Very cool. Don't know what they're used for yet, so you have to read the rule book. No, we'll just put that back in there. We have some cards. We have some more cards. We'll be going through them. Here we have some more cards. This was what I was looking for. Okay, so. Let's see. I'll set them that way. In a minute. All right, so we got that one open. We have cards here. Okay. All right. So, it's, uh, 
Open these cards. Okay, these are actual sleeves for each one. So, leave that there. Leave this here. I'm gonna have to sleeve each one. And it's cool that it comes with the little ones because uh, a lot of times uh, those are hard to find. Okay, so uh, let's see how we're gonna open this. Okay, hopefully I was careful enough. Try not to ever cut the cards. Okay, so we have wormhole, night wielder, firefight, fault line, opportunity, warhead, avalanche. Panel on the death point, conflux, powerhouse, kind of like Bruce Lee, uh, Kingmaker, Big Zone, False Face, Dazzle, Bolt, Curveball, Refractionary, Cinder, Half Life, Frostbite, Ozone. Prestige, Status, Zodiac. We have some, uh, this is a uh, oh, player cards. And so the player cards kind of, we'll look at it more. So, all right. So those are those cards. Okay. Let's uh, open this one. So we have the hotness. Wow, I like the this card. Armsman. Audio. Lightning. Quicksand and Snowfall. Okay, so now we're opening this little, little cards. We have a uh, fuel cell, garbage truck, Nighthawk Mobile, and Media Kick. Okay. Wish all these had the this so I didn't have to use my blade. Still might have to. No. So we have camera, drone, tensors, operations, more cycle, gravitonics, evidence. Immer, or Im image, imager, jacket, sniper, rifle, forensic kit, flash grenade, uh, grenade launcher, gals gun, faith, cinematics, notebooks, explosive, imp, hards, oh, harm's way, lead the way, grenade, trap, twin pistol, bank wall, epic DNA, Provis helicopter, safe house, dozer, bribe, night vision goggles, check, checkmate, and disguise. So I believe that's everything that's included in the box of uh, the Reckoners. Wow, that was a lot. And pretty much I'm very impressed with the Component quality, uh, probably the best uh, component quality I've seen in any game. It's uh, quite a lot still though. And so hopefully the setup time is not uh, tremendous. I don't think so because of the, everything is pretty much uh, tray. So 
Uh, if you like this video, please like and subscribe. Uh, we will be doing also a playthrough and review. And so I'm gonna have a link to the, in the description where to buy the game. Uh, my social media is also in the descriptions and I'll see you in the next video.